So Instagram just launched Instagram TV. It's a separate app, so you'll have to download it from the App Store. And what's great about it, unlike Instagram, you can actually upload it straight from your computer. Because what I plan to do with my Instagram TV page is to take clips of my vlogs, upload it to Instagram TV, and then put a link to my YouTube page. So log into your Instagram page, go to IGTV, click upload, and you click here to upload your video. But if you read here, it says your video must be vertical between 15 seconds and 10 minutes. So I'm gonna take a piece of this vlog, export it, and upload it to Instagram TV. So here's the trick. Hit Command N for new timeline. I'm gonna call this Big Week IGTV. And this is the main thing you need to do. You need to go where it says Video, go to Custom, and where it says 1920 by 1080, just reverse that. Put 1080 by 1920. And now we have a vertical timeline. Go back to the original vlog, and I'm going to take a piece of this right here, and I'm gonna select this range here. Right click, make a new compound clip, hit okay. So then I'll, what I'll do is I'll copy this, go to the new timeline, paste it. There it is. Of course, it scaled it down to fit this uh, this timeline, and you can either upload it like this and have the black at the top of the bottom, or you can. It's a spatial conform. Click on top and hit fill, and then you'll have. She walked away from a cheap pack of cigarettes. You'll have vertical. The only problem with vertical is you can't see everything that's going on in the video, which is sort of annoying. So I'm going to actually scale it down a little bit. So there's a little bit of black at the top and the bottom. Kind of move it over so I can make sure to see my face and what's going on in the background here. And okay, put a little piece of black at the beginning. I like to put one second of black at the beginning. Hit G, put a gap here, make that one second. And you know what I think I'm gonna do? At the end down here, I'm gonna put a title, which is Control T for title, to see the full episode. Go to, right there. Put a dissolve on that. Sir. <laughs> Alright, so. So now we'll let that render. Once I render, export it. Master file. Settings. Uh, let's see. 2264. I think that'll work. Okay. Let's export it. Drag, drop a file. Let's open it up. Ah! It won't let me go to the video, change the MOV, change the MOV extension to MP4. Use MP4. All right, now let's try it. Let's see what this does. Go here, click on that. There you go. MP4. Let's see if this works. Okay, looks like it's working. See the progress bar right here? So that's a trick. If you export as an MOV file, just change the MOV extension to MP4. So I'm gonna call it Big Fun at Harry Styles Concert. So I'm gonna go to my YouTube page and click on Big Week and Harry Styles Concert. Go to Share, get the link, and then paste the link in here. It's done. Uh, I don't wanna share it on my Facebook page. Cover photo must be vertical and JPEG. I guess it's going to create its own cover photo. Preparing video will notify you when it's ready. Okay. So it's preparing the video. This is the one I did earlier today, which was sort of a test video. All right, so there's the video. It's not showing a thumbnail though. Let's see what happens when I click on it. 
Uh, it's actually showing the the title and to see the full video go here. Let's see if it plays correctly. She walked away from a cheap pack of cigarettes. Hard liquor mixed with a bit of intellect. You think all these people are going to Harry Styles? That's what it is. Alright. So it's not giving me an option to make a thumbnail out of the video that's there. So you'll probably have to export a thumbnail out from your timeline or a picture or whatever and put it there. So if you like this video, make sure to subscribe to the channel, like the video, and if you have any questions, comment below.